Hello everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Rugs Mod Hungary, the Hungarian Empire, the Hungariest Empire in the world right now, everybody. This is... Oh yeah, you're trying to build things. I forgot you're not actually going to war. The Hungariest of Empires. The Italian Smashers, apparently, too, um, as we have very, very much so hurt their... Um, well, hurt their everything, to be quite honest. Uh, they're not doing... They're not doing too well right now. Uh, we're starting to get into Padova and stuff, which is going to be a pain in the ass. And uh, Venezuela is, you know, not crap anymore, which kind of sucks for us. But hopefully they don't have anything forward moving anymore, which uh, would be great, because that means we don't have to deal with anything forward moving anymore. Um, I wish I had more planes, obviously, but I don't have more planes. Did we build an aircraft fabrication yet? Did we build any of that yet? No, we haven't yet, because we're still... Because Rube's mod is just so slow at building things that we haven't had the time to build up a proper military thing. I don't think we've taken anything over that has one either, uh, which is a bit of a bother. And then Greece is getting a bit more plucky again. Uh, we made peace with Greece, which is good because I really don't want to have to go to back to war with Greece at the current time. I have other um, concerns at the moment, I guess you could say. Um, I have Italy to deal with, which is all kinds of fun, as you can imagine. Um, I'm hoping I can take over Venezuela without too much of an issue with the Air Force, uh, though I probably won't have that wish, because I never have that wish. We have 22. And there's still seven repairing. So yeah, we really have to uh, rebuild our Vodnik um, stuff. I just had a weird glitch there. The screen went all funky. Um, thankfully, France is distracting them, kind of, um, sort of, not really, I don't know if I'd call it distracting, they are, they are pissing them off, which is helpful, um, pissing them off is very helpful to me, I think I produced one down here, did that not yet, because that means that all of their focus is going to be on France right now, because, you know, they're shoving like three tanks up their ass, um, rather than me, if they have anything forward moving, that is, and then, see, I don't, I, I hate that the Vodniks suck at killing boats. Um, that really bothers me because there's a boat in Venezuela. Or Venezuela, there is a boat in Venezuela. Everybody, newsflash: Venezuela has an evil core. Who would have guessed? No, um, in Venice, Italy. So I want to get rid of that, so I can have Venice, Italy, because that would be a nice town to be able to call my own. Um, of course, the problem being, too, that there's, like, 50 mortars sitting both in the city and in Padova, which sucks. Um, <clears throat> so I'm almost to Padova, at the very least. If I can break past Padova, um, we're in the green, as far as I'm concerned. Um, that's 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 just it. That's, that's all we need to do. Once we get past Padova, it's pretty much all over for the Italians, in my opinion, because they have really nothing left to throw at us besides an air force of course but we've gotten past the air force once we'll get past it again oops not reserve entrench where did you even come from entrench the little army of vodniks they have done so well they have like what have they done they have um taken land from a superpower including our first ever error fabrication once it builds and multiple land fabs they have taken a, a, that chunk of land, yes. Um, they have nullified its forward momentum troops, like tanks and um, infantry and stuff, besides this one BMR and a couple of entrenched things. But, you know, we can't, we can't kill them all. I mean, if they're not coming after us and we haven't gotten to them yet, then they're obviously not going to be dead yet. Um, give it time, give it time. Um, they have uh, tanked a massive air force to the point where they've actually damaged a uh, first world nations air force uh, fairly significantly overall um, they've done they've done some very heavy damage to them um, they have significantly damaged their artillery core to the point where there's only I think there's only two units left of it um, unless you count the one here in Palermo but I don't I, I count the one that's still left in Venice, protecting Venice, and the one that's currently wanting to blow my socks off uh, in Padova. So, yeah, really there's not 
more than two left, which is interesting. And it looks like Greece is going to make one hell of a comeback. Um, because Bulgaria has no more units, and Greece has a few, because they've been kind of saving up. I would not want to be at war with Greece right now. Well, I would, because I want to connect that land, but other I, I would not want to otherwise um, be at war with Greece right now. It's funny, because like, now I have like towns that are in the middle of an area that I don't have access to. Like, those towns are just fucked. Like, they, I can't give them anything. I cannot do anything with them. They're fucked. Completely fucked. For those of you, too, asking, why are you using your main army to go in there and boom, 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 boom? Well, I kind of want my main army to be intact. Um, an Air Force bombing would probably decimate it again, because uh, we're only, well, there's only like 100 units, I think, in this. 126. And I don't want that to be destroyed again, uh, just in case, you know, fucking Belarus gets antsy or Poland starts to hate me or something, or... You know, God forbid, fucking holy shit, Belgium decides to come back at me. Um, there are a lot of units in Belgium right now, or Netherlands decides to come after me again, or who, know, who knows who um, decides to declare war on me. Um, yeah, Belgium declaring war on me right now would be not a great thing. Um, I think it'll be better once we take over Italy, and they get a little bit of the land of it, and I take over a little bit of land, and they start sending units down from Belgium. That's handleable. Uh, I can handle that many... Well, why is there a helicopter in there? I did not order a helicopter. So entrench, entrench. So yeah, it's it's interesting and kind of funny to say that I'm actually nervous about a war with Belgium because they have a capable military, a large capable military. I wish they would just accept peace. Um, they might actually. I like give them enough money. Like, their people like me, but their government really doesn't. Yeah, they're not going to accept peace. Um, I'll just send that off anyway, just off the only off chance. And for some reason, they're like, hmm, yeah, well, hmm, Mr. Mr. President, you're being a little bit of a douchebag. Maybe we should actually just pee. Oh, never mind, actually, fuck them. <laughs> I, just saw, I just saw I got rejected, so they're like, ah, oh, actually, fuck those guys. Bunch of jerks. How dare they help us fight the Italians? Those bastards. How dare they... Just fucking go to war with countries that they have justification against. Those sons of bitches. Yes. I'm... I'm very... Apology. Very apology. 51. Okay, so... Another round of making them should be good, I guess. We got like 75-ish. Something like that. How many land do we have? Wow, we have 25. No, we don't. We have 15. Um, because... Undyne is still repairing. Fucking Bureaucrest is still repairing. That'll take a while. Um, and oh, Undyne we already had. And Wien is still repairing. That's close to finished though, which is nice. So we have 15, so it's like 50. Well, technically he's not one. He can go away. Um, so we have 50, 14, so I'll bring up to 65. Okay, that's not too bad. And those others are fairly close, like Bureaucrest. Bureaucrest has so much supply that won't take as long, because they have more supply. That's, like, nearly fucking finished, but they're going to get, like, bombed to fuck once they, like, produce anything. Um, and then that one's almost done, too, actually. So I think they're all... All the ones that we currently have building repairing are almost done. Wow, they've actually started to damage it. I'm actually surprised. Trench. In trench. So yeah, that's basically what's going on. Is we're just waiting for the Vodniks to build up again. So we can go to war again. Um, France apparently is getting back on its feet. Apparently it has units now again. I don't know when that happened. It'd be interesting to see what happens against Spain when the Italian war wraps up and... The next, who knows how long. Ooh, Belgium's getting pissy. I don't want Belgium to take too much of this land. I don't want Belgium to have a lot of Italy. Like, when I swathe in here, I'm going to go straight across. I want this entire peninsula, if I can get it. I want the entire fucking peninsula. I don't want these bastards to get fucking anything. I want the whole damn thing. I am the one sacrificing hundreds of Vodniks. Like, legit hundreds. I think a hundred of them have been destroyed between now 
and when we started the attack, I'm 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 almost positive that over a hundred have died from this. Um, we can even check our score sheet and just see how many people, how many units we've lost. Yeah, we've lost 391 units. At least a hundred of those are fucking Vodniks, at the very least. We have killed a lot, though. We've killed 929, which means we're fourth for total kills. Apparently the States is doing really well, killing things. Good job, America. Oh, because they're at, like, Panama's doorstep. Are they allies with Panama? No, they're not allies with Panama, which means they're probably going to go to war with Panama. Um, they're at war with Colombia as well, so that'll be interesting. Oh, Colombia's at war with Panama. Oh, interesting. How very interesting. So yeah, the states probably eventually go to war with Panama, and then just annihilate them. They have a lot of tanks down there, like, holy shit. That's a lot of tanks. Plus they've got, you know, soon they'll have more production facilities once, you know, these repair, and apparently they're building one, even. They're like, this. there's not enough in Central America. There's like ten. There's not enough to sustain the military of us. Oh, they're moving them over, because the Belgians got a little bit pissy. The France got a little bit pissy as well. Ooh, there's a tank even. Ooh. Gross. I don't like it. There's something other than a Vodnik in there, and I can't figure out what the fuck it is. Oh, well, I guess we'll find out when we go to war and it dies. Trench. And trench. Any more? Yeah, you. And trench. And you. Trench. Okay. So that's interesting. So that was a tank over there. Oh, they took over that. They took over Torino. Oh my goodness. Well, that's not what I expected to happen at all. It's good to know that the Italians still have an air force that's capable. And they're pulling out all of their shit from Padova all of a sudden. Because they're just like, fuck it. We don't need that stuff in Padova. Fuck that. Dumbasses. You wait till my Vodniks come back, although they're going after Venice first. No, little Vodnik. It's okay. Get the fuck out of there. Get the fuck out of there. Go back. Go repair up there. Oh, hello, Germany. Where the fuck are you going? Um, I don't know. Where are, Where is Germany going? Hold on, I will move my Vodniks for you. I'll let you pass. My Vodniks are not going to kill you. Oh, there's... Ukrainian tanks going on. Oh, it's the Ukraine. They're going to war against the Ukraine. Because the Ukraine pissed them off a little bit. Pity. Don't come this way. I don't want to move my units. No, you bastards. You sons of bitches. Fine. And they're sending a lot of units. Holy smokes. Hello, hung yeah, sure. That'll be an interesting battle, then. Eh, wow, lots of German tanks. Germany has rebuilt its military. It's not helping me out, but, you know, whatever, I guess. What do you do? Don't go into Belgium too much, for God's sakes. You're going to piss off the Belgian military. You do not want to do that. Like, that is just bad news for everybody, because then I've got a fucking Belgian military on my front doorstep. I don't want this on my front doorstep. I don't think I could handle that. Well, uh, maybe. I could probably try to handle that. We have 64. All right. I would like to have at least 80 before going in there. One German tank taking on three and doing a decent job at it. And those are some hardcore missiles. Oh, apparently there's an emergency, if you can't hear. That was not in the game, that was that's outside of my window. I have my window open because it's a very nice day outside. I didn't expect sirens to go by. I apologize. Man, that's gonna that's that's not good, man. They can't take that over like at all. There's so many missiles! Look how many missiles there are! That is so many missiles. Holy tits. Yes, I know we're taking friendly fire. The Vodnik is fine. Those German tanks, though, I don't know. They're just going to sit in my fucking small towns. One British tank is coming to help them, though. So at least they have that. They do have that one one German tank. You can just go down there, I guess. Maybe you can distract them. 
What's going on here? Oh, Germany is pissed off. And, yep, you pissed off the Belgians, you dumb fuck. It's not what you want to do. Pissing off the Belgians is not healthy. <laughs> I guess we'll just go after them. They're not really giving us much choice if fucking Germany's starting to go back into Milan. And I don't want them to get far... If they, like, break through that line... I don't want them to get far enough south. Come on, boys, you got this shit. Look at that, we even produced one more for you. Oh shit, look at that, three more. Six more. Seven more. Fucking take it over. Kill the Gaddisons! Why were you doing okay last time and now you're just like, shh, I'm fucking crap now. Uh, see, they're not good against artillery. They're very, very terrible against artillery fire. Like, they're really, really bad. I might have to go in there with the main military and just take it out myself. So let's entrench up here. Uh, repair. Uh, yeah, you know, you go after that. You get your ass kicked. That's fine. Let's entrench in this town now. Oh, little Vodniks entrench in this town. Little Vodniks. Man, we're getting like heavily bombed here. Holy shit. This is not a friendly environment. I expected better. Jesus Christ, what the fuck was that noise? Did you hear that? I don't think you guys heard that. If you did, the fuck was that noise? Alright, let's see if we can't take this over. It's fucking airplanes, I tell you. It's one thing I really hate about Italy is their air force is way too good. That's really annoying. Cause like it does stupid shit. Repair just fucking go after If you're not going to repair, then you are going after Venice Venice. There you go. Now you can all go and repair somewhere. Because we didn't take over Venice? What? I thought we took over the fucking city of Venice. Is that stupid boat really? Really? That stupid boat? Actually? That's actually what? What? Really? Really? Fucking really? It's that stupid ass boat. Uh, I'm getting mixed up. Blood mix with other things. Kill the boat. It's just a boat. It is only a boat. Yay, we finally killed a fucking boat. Let's help out the Vodniks. Let's just kill everything we can. Because the Vodniks are repairing quickly. I was going to say, weren't there Vodniks up there too? Yes, there are. Oh my goodness, Air Force. Holy shit. Everybody run. <sighs> Repair. Because it's really fun. Trench. Okay, well, oh, well, we did get that, I guess, technically. Right now we have to go and try to not get destroyed. See, those fucking ships are really annoying. I hate boats. Light. Guys, I'll wait until everything gets in, though. Okay, there we go. You guys can go up there. Anything non Vodnik related can go up here. How many units did we lose? We lost a fair amount, I think. Oops. I think I'm pretty sure we got pretty badly beat up. How many Vodniks are there? 85 Vodniks. Now that's not all Vodniks. I think there's a couple of infantry things in there too. I think. We got to wait for... Once those planes stop, we'll go in with the Vodniks. But not before, because those planes will just rip us apart. Well, they won't rip us apart, but they're not going to... It's not going to be pretty um, if we go in there beforehand. What's there now? 27 units. Oh, 
I mean, 56. Yeah, we got beat the fuck up. Like, pretty badly. That's almost done. That's getting close. So I'll have them dedicated to, like, tanks and stuff. We have enough Vodnik production. We don't need any more. We do not need any more Vodnik productions. We have enough. God damn, those planes really don't want to fuck off, do they? Uh, sure, we'll send you petroleum. Didn't realize we were such a big producer of petroleum, but apparently we are. And the Belgians and the French really, really want that thing. Yeah, planes go there. Why are you still here? Fuck off. Trench, entrench, entrench, come on, 14, a couple of BTRs, some artillery, there's that siren again, apparently they don't want to leave me alone. I wonder what happened. I live in a very small town. Um, well, before, you know, right now, before we move, I live in a small town, and, um, not a lot goes on, but apparently today there's a lot going on. Seriously, airplanes, like, are you just that bored? You just want to keep coming back? You know, so actually, you're actually under attack over here, right? You know, you could, you're, you're, you're actually under, like, actual gunfire, people are actually dying, you know, you could, you could fucking help them out. But no, no, we'll just keep circling over a base that we no longer control, that there are no military units at. Which we should probably make sure there actually are some military units, just in case their military units decide to make a comeback of sorts, which can happen. As Greece has shown, they have taken back most of their nation, funnily enough. And if they could build a fucking bridge, then they'd be okay. Unfortunately, they are too stupid to build a fucking bridge. This, this just in. Greece can't build a bridge. Nation known for massive major architecture cannot build a bridge. Breaking news. Okay, I think the planes have fucked off now. I think they're more interested in France trying to take over Torino. Which they should be, to be quite honest. So let's put these guys up here. I really want to take out those boats. I wonder if we have the air power. We probably don't. We can certainly try. Oh wow, we actually have the air power. That's amazing. Zoom. Oh no, that didn't work out. It's a good try though. And now we only have aircraft bombing us. Two airplanes bombing us. So I consider that I chalk that up as a win. How many years do we have here? 82. Ugh, yuck. That was not beneficial to anybody. Well, I guess it was. We lost like 20 units, but we did take uh, Venice and Padova as well as the military barracks there. So all they have now is just the artillery here trying to, you know blow me up. Hopefully that won't work. Hopefully that will not work. Hoping I have enough Vodniks just to overwhelm them with numbers. But we still have to take out a bunch of garrisons. So I guess we'll see what happens. We did somehow make that ship retreat though. So we're not being bombed on the coast anymore. Hooray! That's good. I like not being, you know, bombed continuously. When did the Ukraine get their military back, anyway? Same with Belarus. I don't remember this happening. Hmm. 
Oh well. Swedes. I'm surprised they still want to war me. I wish Belgium wouldn't want to war me. I don't want to war Belgium. Like, I really don't want to war Belgium. Alright, let's see if we can't take this over. Let's hope the planes leave us the fuck alone. There's no military thing. There's research centers. I don't think that counts as a military setting, though, does it? I mean, it might. Okay, I can take a couple of bombings there. That's that's okay. Like, I can take that. Now, let's see if we can't take over this. If we can take this over we're, and destroy all this shit, then um, it's pretty much all over from there. We've, uh, we, we just have to break into the rest of Italy. Uh, we got them. Blow them up, boys. Blow them all up. Destroy them. Don't leave any of them alive. get across the river here that almost makes Italy an island it does too look at that cut Jesus shing right across just south of Milan Milano whatever it's a lot of uh, very nice scenery in there Wow they have tanks apparently and they're not even using them we are the Italian military we are the smartest in the world apparently not really. We're getting defeated by a bunch of Vodniks that literally cost no, almost nothing. We're hungry to build. This is the cheapest takeover in the world. Which is sad when you think about it. Oh man, there's a military thing up here. Everybody hold on. We got us some, some boats. I don't like me. I don't like me boats. Oh, we got. Also have a tornado. I don't want to even think about how many missiles they actually have stored up there. That's that's scary. Um, hmm. Should we go down this way? Or should we go continue to go across and then down? Uh, it's hard to say. We have a tank there. Hmm. Tanks gonna come after us. It's gonna get beat the fuck up by a bunch of Vodniks. Not die. He's gonna get beat the fuck up. Oh uh, no, he's dead. He died. <laughs> he did not make it. Those stupid boats are gonna launch things at me. Apparently, they're the Italians are also gonna launch military at me anyway. Or not? They're gonna go over and take over parts of France because they're dumb. Oh, Lewis, apparently the Vodniks have gotten into our stuff. They're attacking us. They're taking over. They're on the peninsula. Oh, well, then. What should we do? Oh, nothing. Let's just let them come. Oh, well, that seems like a smashing idea. Apparently Italians are now fucking, like, French. Oh, shit, they're fucking coming. Go away. Go away. Go away. This is my town. I want bologna. Bologna is mine. Give, let me have a bologna. Thank you. Hold on, let's let's fortify bologna before we go any further than that, because apparently they do have. Oops, that was not smart. Um, apparently, they do have uh, actual military. Oh, who knew? I certainly didn't. Trench. Because I thought I had decimated that. I mean, they don't have any artillery left. I've destroyed that. Um, you know, besides what's left in beautiful Rome. But, you know. Well, well whatever. So, we've got these guys now. 
Man, Italy's like completely fortified itself. Full fucking garrisons the whole damn way. Oh my goodness, Italy. Calm your tits. Just give up. Give up, Italy. Give up. I don't think I have much risk of that being taken from us. We could probably take down here and then go down across there, just so we're not running into so many fucking towns and shit. And then we'll probably still get this stuff anyway. We could probably, like, at the end, just have a Vodnik here. Just go in there or something. So we'll take over this way. Um, just because it seems like a smarter idea. What are you doing, everybody? Keep attacking. Take out the Chinooks. Apparently there's Chinooks there. Oh, you can go. You guys can attack. I feel that I just get a refresh of fucking Vodniks every two or three minutes. Yeah, they got boats down there. That's a problem. I don't think we have an air, air, air assault good enough. Which means we're gonna have to take them out with Vodniks. <laughs> Which isn't really good. I don't want to do that. I don't know. Maybe our Air Force is good enough. No, they're not. We're not going to take all of them. It took like two. We have supply here. Fuck off. Calm down. Everybody. Let's just entrench for a minute. Let's everybody just... Everybody just... Let's have a... Let's have a little, a little pow. A little sit down. You know. Figure out what's going on. Get bombed at by fucking boats, apparently. Hopefully we can just destroy those boats. I don't really know how that's going to work, but... Hopefully we can just destroy those boats. Or we could just, you know, fuck those boats and just diagonally come down, which is also a possibility, and just avoid the boats entirely. Which is probably something I could do. Um, I should do. I should do that. I should just do that. Fuck it. Just go diagonally down. Send down this way. They're just like, ah, oh, they're coming for us. They're gonna be here. We're gonna be ready for them. We're gonna kill those bastards. Wait, wait, where, where, where the fuck are they? Fuck did they go? What, what the fuck? Where they fucking go? Where the fuck they fucking go? Doody doody do. This just in. Arezzo was taken over by a large Vodnik military. How the fuck they get down here? Little shit fox. Entrench. Oh, there is a Sinharo. Oh, Scary. Fuck is bombing us there? Who is bombing us there? Something bombed there. What bombed there? The, the legitimate question. Who bombed? Who done bombed? Build a road. And... Like, up there, I guess. Ooh, stop it. Stop it. It's not nice. It's very rude. Semi-helicopters. All two of them. To get blown up. Oh, well, we, we damaged that ship, I guess. You know, with some dents in the hull. Oh, no. That's a rhino moving. Where the fuck are you going? That's my question. Yeah, where are you going? Oh, you're going to try and attack me. Okay. That's fine. Hold on. Oh, I was hoping he would come after me. So apparently we're going to have to shore up that town as well. Oh, yep, he's coming after me. Okay, good. He's just going to die. Oh, he's not going to die. Wah, wah, wah. Thought he was. This is, where, this is where confidence gets you, folks. You think he was going to die, and then it just wasn't so. All right, so we've got we've got a fairly stable Vodnik advance now. We're pretty deep into the peninsula. Holy shit! We're pretty close to Rome, to be fair. Should we take over that town? Yeah, we should take over that town. Take over this town. Vodnik's apparently just going to drive across the lake. 
How scary would that be? Not only are you being attacked by cheap little Vodniks and losing terribly, but they're coming across the fucking lake at you. There's not even, like... They're not even, like, coming on the ground. They're just like, swim across the lake, guys. We're fucking Vodniks. Apparently we are aquatic now. Fuck. What the hell? Now the question is, do we surround Rome? Probably should surround Rome, to be fair. Yeah, see, that guy's got the right idea. Oops. Mm, entrench. Everybody entrench. Because if you don't, we're going to get rocket launch status anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter if we entrench. So I'm just going to launch something at me anyway. Those fucking boats. I can't wait. I, I don't want to destroy them, actually, because I want them to be mine. I want those to be my boats. No, stop it. One we'll trench there. I want those to be my boats. My pretty little boats. Pew 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 Boom, boom, boom. Boom, explosion, explosion, boom. We'll trench there for a moment. Let's have this guy be the guy that's gonna go like go across here once when the time eventually does come around. Which could be a while. I don't know. This might be a longer episode because I want to get I want to get at least to Rome's doorstep. If I take it over, great. But I want to at least get to their doorstep. I don't think I I don't think I can take Rome over though this time because that air force is just gonna pumble the crap out of me. Plus I got like two towns to deal with. My, what I might have to do is I'm gonna take over. Boom, boom, boom. Maybe that, 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 and that city, and then go after Rome from this diagonal. Because that just seems like the most plausible um, at this time, if that makes any sense. Most, most, most plausible. I guess I can move these guys like down in here now. They're not going to be bombed. Oh look, they're sending a mortar to protect the capital. Probably a good idea, to be honest. Yeah, let's take this down. It's the one that's you know closest on the radar. Plus, it's the one where we get attacked by fucking things that we shouldn't get attacked by. Maybe I'll leave the suspense. Maybe I'll do Rome next. Where are you going? You idiot. Are you going to do that too? Oh, 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 no. Oh, no. We have a problem. Build military barracks temp. Let's build a temporary barracks here, I guess. Oh shit, there's a tank. Isn't that great? Well, we have to kill the tank. Because it is a tank. Okay, now we can go and entrench. Entrench. Oh. I guess that's a problem, isn't it? Um... Okay, let's entrench them up here. Because we don't want that happening, because we need to keep resupplying the Vodniks. Goodness. But now you have the big problem where they're not going to that. Well, they are going to that one, but they're not going to that one. Which is very problematic. As you can very well imagine. So now we gotta wait for that temp barracks to build, which sucks. So I don't want to. I want to be able to go after Rome. But I'm gonna end the episode here, guys, because it looks like I'm gonna be I'm stalled out a little bit. I have to wait for that barracks to build um, before we can actually do anything. So um, yeah, um, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you all next time. Peace.